What are you doing? Oh, we're live? Yeah. Paige Van Zandt, she should stick to OnlyFans. Um, you know, she looked great on OnlyFans, but she didn't look great, you know, in her last fight. And her last fight was in late July versus Rachel Ostovich, who also should be on OnlyFans as well. And she obviously, Paige Van Zandt obviously lost, dropping her uh, bare knuckles fighting championship record to 0-2. You know, uh, her first loss to uh, Britain Hart. And, you know, that was her debut. A lot of hype. She lost that one. She lost this one. Paige Van Zandt recently opened up to, you know, the, the loss stating, when I walked out of the ring, I didn't just walk to my locker room. I literally walked all the way outside and I just went and cried in the parking lot by myself. I said some things to my husband that are pretty terrible about like my mental state. I told him I didn't want to, I didn't want to live anymore, that this wasn't for me, like life wasn't for me anymore. So I was disappointed. It was hard. Very serious. I mean, her mental state after a loss. What, what do you think about that? Definitely strong words coming off a, of, you know, a big loss. You should, do you blame her for that? You know, taking it that serious or what? You know, the great athletes, they think like that maybe. I don't know if they take it to that, you know, that far, but I don't know. You know, but uh, the president of the Bare Knuckles Fighting Championship, he also stated that this is the Paige's, you know, next fight. You know, it's a must win. I mean, she's 0-2. If she goes 0-3, that's not going to be a great, you know, look for the for her or the, you know, the BKFC. But, uh, you know, she reportedly makes, you know, like I was stating about OnlyFans, she makes... You know, reportedly, this all alleged, you know, that she makes more money selling her contents, you know, online than she ever did in the UFC and her deal with the bare knuckle fighting championship. So, I mean, if that's true, I mean, this is, again, all reportedly, if that's true, that she makes more money, you know, selling content, what, you know, why is she still fighting? It must be that she, you know, she still loves fighting. You know, you can't knock, knock on her for doing, for keeping on, you know, on that path. So you think, obviously, the president of the Bare Knuckles Fighting Championship, you know, he said it's a must win. Her next fight, do you think that's going to be pressure added onto her? You yeah, think she sure. can handle it? Or you don't Definitely think? pressure added, and, you know, we'll see if she handles it. No, what she didn't look too great against her fight. I mean, her two fights, to be honest, um, you know, it's literally just boxing, so you can't throw kicks. It's just uh, one aspect of her game, so I don't know. I don't think she's going to. I don't think she's going to thrive in the BKFC, in my opinion. But, I mean, she, you know, she, there, and there's one thing that she can't thrive, and that's for sure, and that's on OnlyFans. So, uh, you guys, go check her out on OnlyFans. Link down below. But, once again, thank you guys for watching uh, Dual Sided. Follow us on Dual Sided down below. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. And comment down below your thoughts. Thanks for watching. Peace.